All right, guys. You know, I've been out of the Navy for a while now. I've been feeling a little stagnant in life. I think I'm ready to uh, pick up and continue my service to my nation once again. So we are here uh, to meet with a Space Force Admiral. Uh, and he is going to run me through the Space Force physical standards test this morning to see if I qualify for service with the United States Space Force. Uh, let's go meet Instructor Chili. Instructor Chile, uh, Airman Wright reporting for as duty. Admiral Chile. Admiral Chile, Airman Wright reporting as uh, as ordered. All right, look, we got this hot shot Navy SEAL here that, that apparently is he thinks he's some big deal and whatever. Where's your cigar? Where's your scooter? Uh, you, you just you're standing here like a pansy in your in your green shorts and your and your trail shoes. If you're going to be in the Space Force, you got to understand that there's a strict code, all right? Every, every spaceman, not an airman, has a scooter and a cigar, okay? So right off the bat, we're starting, we're starting on a bad note, but today we're going to do a Space Force fitness test, um, see if this, this young recruit can, can pass the minimum standards uh, to get into the most elite fighting force in the universe, uh, not the world, uh, the universe. So. We'll see what he's got. I'm ready. All right, the first test of the Space Force Fitness Standards Test is a one mile run. However, the Space Force is different than any other branch of the military. Uh, there's really not a whole lot of forward running. You're gonna be in a lot of disoriented uh, situations. So this test is a backwards mile. All right, so that's four laps on the track, running backwards, the standard is 10 minutes. Let's see what Holy you got. Holy crap. <laughs> Good luck, young spaceman. Tell me when to go, Admiral Instructor Chili. All right. Three, two, one, bust them. This is going to be rough, son. I hadn't ran backwards in probably a decade. My legs are going to be freaking As you can see, tomorrow. he's uh, running in lane six, which is an odd choice considering lane one would be the fastest lane. So right off the bat, we, we, we've, uh, he didn't have a cigar, he didn't have a scooter, and he's running in lane six. I mean, this is one of the worst recruits I've ever seen in my life. Struggling, struggling bad. All right, son, three I'm, more laps. I'm right on pace. Get off that center line. Yeah, thank you. Freaking rookie. My legs are going to be wrecked tomorrow. I don't know if you heard that, but he just said his legs are going to be wrecked. Already negative talk. I, I, I don't like anything I'm seeing. This is... I may just end the test because this is a joke. Why are you even here, man? Did you not want to be here? Did you not know what this was going to be like? What are you doing? The Space Force test was rough. They didn't make me do this in the Navy. Yeah, freaking Navy. That's all I hear about is the Navy. This is the Space Force. Why are you here? I love my job. I'm thirty. Good gosh. Show them your time. You did track it, right? Yeah. 
Well, at least you did something I'm right. I'm in good standing. At least you did something right, not expecting me to track everything for you. Um, well, you passed my five seconds, so great job. Now we're gonna move on to phase two, all right? You have a one minute rest, and then we'll move right into a five minute plank. Five minutes is the minimum standard. Roger that. Thank you, Space Force Instructor Chili. That's Admiral Chili. Admiral Chili. You, you've got about one more time to mess up on that before I cut this off. Roger that, Admiral Instructor Chili. On you, Spaceman Wright. What's the standard? Five minutes. Five minute plank? Yes, sir. Roger that. Did you bring water out here, Admiral Instructor Chili? Don't ask me for water. When we're in space, uh, how do we get water? You think I'm gonna tell a prospective recruit all these questions? I'm not your third grade teacher. I'm just curious about my service in the Space Force. Y'all hear how he's talking to me? I see, ah. I see Spaceman Wright is already employing the, uh, the back, the, the, basically the, the method that absolutely fuses your bottom two, <laughs> <laughs> your bottom two vertebrae on the spine. That is allowed, but it, it will come with some repercussions. seconds. Pah. Pah. Ah. I ain't gonna be able to move tomorrow. Probably gonna have hemorrhoids after this. <sighs> Stay calm, spaceman recruit, right? Stay calm. Admiral, I'm at five minutes. Can I recover? Request permission to recover. You can recover. Well, he did it. You've passed two of the four elements to this test. One minute recovery, then phase three, which is push-ups. Roger that. Phase three. You've done good, you've done good. I gotta admit, on the first two, you've passed them. Phase three, push-ups. 60 seconds, the standard is 10. That may sound low, but the Space Force doesn't have many uh, upper body requirements, so you should pass this with flying colors, all right? 60 seconds, minimum standard 10, on you. Excellent job. Spaceman Admiral Instructor uh, Chelly requests permission to recover. Permission granted. That's just a testament to all you people who spend all this time doing all these push-ups out there. That's all you need to be able to do. He's good for, he's good for space. Just have to be able to defeat gravity. Let's go, Edgar! <laughs> all right. The fourth and final phase of the Space Force Fitness Test is 50 air squats straight into a 400 meter run. The time starts when your run starts and the standard is 60 seconds. This is a very difficult phase, but Spaceman Wright has got here, so he should be able to do it. Um, let's see what you got. It's pretty much that simple. Roger that. Spaceman uh, recruit, right? 
Good gosh. Standing by. He's, he's gone mentally insane. Uh, yeah, 50, 50 air squats, straight into the run, start your timer. 60 second standard on the run, on you. What the crap are you doing? You didn't give me a standard for time on the squats. Well, I would hope that anybody who really cared about this would do 50 consecutive. Good gosh, what a freaking weasel. You've exhibited a lot of behavior that is not conducive to qualifying for the most elite force in the universe. I'll have, you, I'll have you know, Spaceman Wright, it is, it is up to my discretion, even if you pass the fitness test, on whether or not you will move on. Remember that. I will get better, Admiral Instructor. Chili. Chili. Thank you. I've been out of the, I've been out of the game for a while. Well, Spaceman Wright, you've come this far. 60 seconds is what stands in your way. There's 40. From becoming a member, potentially, of the most elite fighting force in the universe. 60 seconds. How bad do you want it? You've passed three phases. Final phase. There's 50. He ain't gonna make it. Well, Spaceman Wright, what's your time? Just like that. Ah, it was 113. 113. Well, just like that. Yeah, Spaceman Wright's journey has come to an end like 99.9% .9 of the rest of the recruits. Good job. Next! I, I have to come back better. Guys, this ain't over. I will achieve the right to go to Space Force Recruit Training Command. Wait and see. A lot of arrogant people say the same thing and never do it. So we'll see if this Navy hotshot can ever pass the most elite test in the universe. <laughs>